He wanted to be filmed this morning. <laughs> Good morning. That's not how I would characterize it, but all right. Uh, it is almost nine. We got up a little while ago to start getting ready, but we were in a rush. Well, I was. Derek's been working his walkie-talkie. He's been going, and he's had to answer, like, questions about, where is this? Oh, yeah. They haven't checked in yet. Um, where's my table? Where's my thing? And you have the wrong table. I need power. Or why, 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 why? It's been, it's been very cute. He's very nice. He's all like, go for Derek. It's kind of cool. It's a little sexy. Um, look at that face. Oh, look at him. Today is Derek's one big kind of like busier day because today is the first day of like events starting to happen right so today is the day hey today's the day where we're where it's people are getting into their space uh, interacting with the system interacting with their hqs for the very first time so this is when all the problems float to the top right i'm supposed to have this i don't have that blah 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 so derek's just like look at him he's so cute he's just spending a lot of his time fixing problems and stuff i'm on my way to my second seminar of Gen Con 101. It starts in 15 minutes. I'm a little bit late. Time. Derek says I have time. I don't know where it is. He knows where it is. <laughs> and uh, we'll see you there. Hello. What's your name? Justin. Justin, nice to meet you. He, nice he just came you. to my, he watched my video and he came to my Gen Con 101 seminar. Yeah. Uh, did I do okay? You did very good. Yeah, did, did you find it helpful? Very helpful. Was yeah. there stuff you didn't know? Uh, yeah, well, again, I, I got a lot from your okay. videos, but yeah, some of the free events I didn't, I wasn't aware of. Awesome. Cool. Um, what are you most looking forward to this Gen Con? Uh, I'm doing some Starfinder events, so I'm pretty excited Oh, about dang. Those. Okay, cool. Yeah. Have you been playing it like at home and stuff too? Uh, just a couple times, but not Starfinder. Okay, cool. Well, thanks for saying hi. Yeah. So my seminar went pretty well that second time around. Um, the room was much bigger, so there was less engagement from people, but we still had fun. I think it went well. I'm just kind of glad they're done. Um, I don't know. It still makes me a little nervous to be like on a stage like that. Ooh, you're fine. Uh, also, be careful with your big giant bags because they're you're gonna roll over people like that lady just rolled over me. I'm not really mad at her for doing that. I'm just annoyed that she's got that bag, and the reality is that she will roll over people. Like. Just be aware of your space, like don't bring a giant rolling bag and expect not to bump into people. Like just... Uh. very briefly into the front left corner of the exhibitor hall at the Paizo area just to meet up with some people but I am going straight to the Western right now because I will be doing live streaming with Gen Con uh, using the backpack again well 
we call it the backpack, but there's no backpack this year, I think. And uh, I'll be doing that for two hours. And then I am meeting up with Stuart and we're gonna go explore the exhibitor hall. And it's gonna be amazing. Um, at the Westin, there's no staff here right now, and I'm just sitting down for a minute because there's no other seats, and everybody's asking me questions about like, where's my event? And I'm like, well, let's look at the program guide together. I have a mat map, and uh, if you have an event ticket, we can figure out where your event is. Uh, I just, I just think, I just thought that was kind of funny. <laughs> Turns out, if you have a program guide, you probably have all of the answers that anybody's gonna ask you. That and like the Gen Con app because you can find out any location of anything using the maps and you can show people where things are. And uh, if you have the app, it gives you access to all the events and where they are and their locations and stuff. So I'm not saying that anybody should hijack an HQ and run it. And that's absolutely not what I'm doing. I'm literally just sitting here. But if I happen to know the answer to the question, I'm answering it. But if anybody stops you or looks lost and you have a program guide and the Gen Con app, you can almost always figure out the answer for somebody um, it just you just need to you know know where in the program guide to find the information so you can do it right now do <laughs> He dropped it onto our houses. He dropped it into our yard. The man they called Jane, he stole away our pain and headed out for the stars. Here's your turn. He robbed from the rich and he gave to the poor. Stood up to the man and he gave him what for. Our love for him now ain't hard to explain. The hero of Kansas, the man they called Jane. how much I hate the food trucks and now I remember why the lines it's hot first of all it's like 90 uh, second of all the lines are so long like it looks like the lines are like 25 ish minutes third of all there's nowhere to sit and eat your food and fourth it's expensive and um, so I'd rather wait a little longer at a restaurant have a proper meal and you know like that's just that's just a personal preference of mine everybody else is different Hi Sawada. Hi Nelly. How's your day going? Ah, uh, it's been busy, but it's kind of fun. I got a whole bunch of word compliments about my hair. Oh, I love your hair I too. I don't know, I like it too. I want to try on the narwhal head. Ooh, so all right.
the game is to get four of these in a row. Okay. So the cranes would be winning right now. The game would be over. Okay. Uh, at the beginning of the game, you're going to randomly get one of these. Okay. Uh, depending on how many people you play with, it can be two to four. Okay. So it's always going to be a four by four map. Okay. Uh, and they shift. So when you want to, when you want your, uh, when you start, you're going to take your piece. And it's going to shift all those down. The one at the end you take, and that'll be the next tile you use to enter the map. To, to move it around. To, okay. Yep, to shift the board around. So it's complicated. <laughs> it's not super, not super hard. There is quite a bit as far as like options. There are a lot of options because you'll see there there's five different uh, hold types you can use. Uh, and they're going to kind of go along with these. So like I said, you get one of these at the beginning okay. and one of these is going to flip over every turn. Okay. So what you're trying to do is you're trying to match that, that set with your pieces here. So right now... You would be able to pick that up and use that because the crabs are in that pattern. Okay. But if I were to pick it up and I have this card, I would be able to use it because you have to have the same corresponding symbol on the bottom. Okay. However, if player four were to pick it up, they would be able to use that and then they'd also get to use this because they have an additional movement. Mm -hmm. uh, so like I said, the, the different folds are going to do different things that are going to help you move other people around, move yourself around a little faster. So they're already folded in the box? No. The We're oh. going to include like 20 pieces of origami paper and an instruction manual that's okay. going to tell you how to make them. Okay. Uh, but when I did it, it looked like a uh, crumbled up gum wrapper. Yeah. So I don't use those. I use <laughs> the wooden like, meatballs that we include in the game <laughs> because I'm really bad. Okay. So... Um, how many players? Two to four. And then how long does it take to play in the age range? Uh, age range is six plus because uh, it really, the movement is, as far as like moving, it's really easy as far as like the game goes, as far as the mechanics. The mechanics are really easy. There is There are just a lot of options because uh, you can basically just move around the whole time without having to use those folds. Um, you can just move them. Uh, All right. Well, I mean. 15, 30 minutes, fairly quick. We are getting ready to release in the beginning or the middle of October. And then if you sign up on our emailer right there, we're going to give you a $5 off coupon uh, that we'll mail to you in the next uh, next few weeks. Uh, we ship free in the U.S. So uh, cool. awesome. you don't have to pay for shipping. Or Thank you. Yeah, no problem. That's awesome.
I'm Jessica, and let me see your outfit. What are you dressed up as today? Cheshire cats. That's adorable. Are you gonna walk in the costume? Walk? I don't know if I'm brave enough for that. You can do it. Okay, I'll give it a whirl then. <laughs> you can do it because I'm gonna record it and it'll be on the internet. Okay. Um, what are you most looking forward to at Gen Con? I'm um, 2 a.m. playing uh, Hitler. Are you excited to be Hitler? Or are you just gonna? I always get Hitler. Oh, so they always funny. shoot me right away. That's funny. <laughs> A, uh, an intense 5 to 10 player party game for social manipulation, voting in variable player powers. Players, to win, the players will use whatever means at their disposal to convince other players to vote for their friends and enemies into the UN. You must be careful though, when only two leaders remain, they will convince the UN to vote for whoever's crowned the supreme leader. I'm Patty. I'm Tom. Patty and Tom came to my event. Was it good? Oh, it was great. great. Thank you. Okay. Great. What do you think of Shipwreck Arcana? We love it. Yeah. They great. have a booth in the hall, like 2,500 something. So if you want to check them out, you should. Um, I have a question for you, okay. and I want you to answer separately. What is the one thing that people should try at Gen Con? And it has to be one answer, quick and concise. Uh, gaming with Maui. <laughs> I need a bigger boat. <laughs> and what would you say? I believe it's the Hungry Hungry Hippos tournament. The champion world championship on world Sunday? Champion. Yes. That's funny. Okay. Uh, thank you very much. Thanks, Thanks. for coming. Nice, nice, to meet you. nice to meet you. Can you all <laughs> introduce yourself? I'm too short. Can you all introduce yourselves? Please. I'm Tommy. I'm Lizzie. I'm Aaron. Aww. Hi guys, Aaron. Aaron, this is your second time at my event, but you're also coming back another day, right? Yes. Stop. Uh, I'm cutting Tom out. That's all right. <laughs> Where are you guys from? Nashville, uh, Tennessee. Yeah, we're from Nashville. Uh, did you drive? Yeah, we did. That's we awful. Yeah, we drove up yesterday. So. How long did it take? Four hours. Five four hours. Oh, okay. Yeah, so I'm, I'm from Ireland, and if you drive three and a half hours, you hit the other side. <laughs> so road trips are like two hours in and out. Wow. So I'm not used to driving more than that. Yeah, so. it's not a bad drive. Yeah, it, oh. I mean, not by our standards. <laughs> and where did you come from? I, I just, with just on the other side of Indianapolis. Man, you have no excuse. <laughs> yeah, 45 minutes, that's it. Man. Uh, well, what has been the most exciting experience so far, and what are you most looking forward to? Um, uh, well, I really liked this. I loved meeting you, and I'm not just saying that for the video. <laughs> I can Thank confirm you. she's not just saying that for the you video. You can give yeah. me a bad review on Yelp. <laughs> so yeah, uh, this was definitely um, my favorite part so far, Thank and then you. I'm really excited um, to see the vendor hall because I haven't seen that yet. And then mm -hmm. I'm also doing the Critical Role panel on Saturday, yes. so I'm really excited about Are that. Are you going to go and cosplay? Yes, I am. Awesome. Hey, how about you, sir? Uh, I'm also looking forward to the Critical Role. Yeah. Okay. I think that'll be fun. We started listening to that together. Yeah. So. I was entertained. I've listened um, to more than he has. He has. Um, and I like the vendor hall, so I, I'm looking forward to also going back over there and finding more games. Okay. Well, thank you. Aaron, what are you most looking forward to? I'm going to keep that in. What are you most looking forward to, and what have you already done that is exciting? Could you put on your hat? Today, I played Munchkin. Because I am the Munchkin. That's adorable. That's, that's what I did today. I played Munchkin. Okay. And tomorrow? 
All right, like what are you most looking forward to in the next few days? Tomorrow, well, tomorrow I got something planned that I did I had on my wish list last year that I didn't get it a chance to do. It's called Deep Space 10. Oh, wow. It's a LARP. I'm playing the Klinger. Oh, nice. Oh, that's really cool. Cool. Yeah, and then, <laughs> and then I'm doing party games the rest of the night. That sounds great. Big, yeah. glorious party games. Are you going to cosplay for the Klingon? Um, no, I don't have anything for a Klingon. Yeah, that's that'd be a bit heavy makeup wise. <laughs> Spider-Man and uh, you? Takashi from Naruto. Cool. <laughs> yeah, fair. Uh, uh, yes, what are your names? Uh, I'm Corey. And Lucas. From? Uh, Tennessee, East Tennessee. We drove like seven and a half hours to get up here. Why? Yeah. First, Gen first ever Gen Con. First yeah. ever. You, when did you get here? Uh, let's see. We got here yesterday at like, what, one or two-ish, something like that. And uh, then we went to the stink yesterday and we honestly... You didn't see me? No, I didn't see you there. I looked because I remember you saying you were going to be there, but I yeah. looked for you and I didn't see you. We were a little late, to be fair. Yeah, we were, we were pretty late. We didn't get there until like six. So. Oh, weird. Okay, well, questions. Yes. You may not be able to answer the first, but what was the <laughs> best thing that you've experienced at Gen Con so far? Dumbest thing, and it's hilarious because this is how me and him are. Those little scooters that you ride around town. Oh, the they're oh so my God. fun! Like, like we, we're, we're, we're killing it on those things. It's been so great. I'm you're so gonna choose afraid. The scooters. Of... Yeah, I'm choosing scooters. They're so you fun. You choose the scooters. I'm gonna say we've met a couple of really like people, big YouTubers that we watch on a regular oh. basis. Oh, and now go. I guess we'll have to add you to the list because this is a whole other thing. Yes. So like, now you. Everyone oh. has been super nice. Like that yes. is such a, a, a relief. Mm -hmm. Honestly, like we met the Nerdarchy guys literally like an hour and a half ago. Mm -hmm. And then yesterday, I met Cody from Take 20, and like, again, That's all of them, awesome. they were just like so genuine, it was like amazing. Like, nice. I, we loved meeting the people, like how nice they were, it was great. What are you looking forward to the most in the next couple of days of Gen Con? So we had a very packed day today, the rest uh -huh. of the week we kind of took it light, uh, but the thing I'm definitely looking forward to the most is, yeah. I credit them for getting me into the hobby, is seeing Dice Tower tomorrow. That's oh, how yeah. I, like, yeah, yeah. I cannot wait for that. Uh -huh. So like we very visited the booth twice, kind of, uh, and like I've all kind of merged, and none of the guys were there. So I'm like, I will hunt you down. <laughs> yeah, and they're usually like they will hang out until they're done talking to everybody. Yes, so. like like they that's like cool. that's because of how they are. So yeah, right. yes. What are you? Sir? And for me, I'm going to go see uh, the Crit Show, which is one of my favorite yeah, podcasts. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then we're going to go to the Indiana Report Theater after for the after party. So I didn't know that was a thing. You that's should cool. go RSVP Maybe. on their Twitter because it's going to be awesome. Cool. Yeah. I didn't know it was a thing. I might do that. Yeah. Okay. Well, yeah, we've been talking about that for a while. That's going to be a lot of fun. Huh. Yeah. Thank you for saying hi. Yeah. Hey, no, thank you. Hey. Hey. you. Hey, subscribe bye. to this girl. Subscribe. She's the best. <laughs> thank you. Bye-bye. Doses. Please let me play. I'll play everybody's shadow. And he's like, fine. And, he, he, and they, so I got all the shadows. And normally, like, it's a circle thing where you play yourself, but you're playing somebody else's dark side. I um, mean, it can get a little weird because you're trying to play. Understand what they, yeah, um, but I played understand. all the shadows. Oh, and I was so happy because by the end of the game, I had gotten everyone killed or, or sent into, like, some sort of mind spiral, <laughs> except for one person. And who at the very end, I got them to admit that they could not accomplish anything without the help of their dark side and they were worth it. I was like, yes, revel the power of evil. So um, I'm now, it's almost 2 a.m. Derek's asleep, he's snoring a little bit. It's almost 2 a.m. I'm just finished editing my video. And uh, 
We're just going through and finishing up all of the last minute things. I'm about to start exporting it. Should take like 30, 45 to an hour. Um, I don't know if I'll stay up <laughs> because that would be 3 a.m. Um, but I, I didn't, I didn't get much of a chance to really speak to any of you, like viewers, very much today. And uh, I had a really good day. Um, it was a little rushed today. I had a bunch of different things on my plate, but I loved running Nelly's Nerdy Game Time. That's just. It's just the best thing. And then um, the drink on stream went okay. I'm a little anxious and nervous about being on that, but that's okay. It's just a lot of people watching live. Um, yeah, I'm a little sad I didn't get to see the running of the, the nerds into the exhibit hall today because I usually try to catch that. Stuart so took a video of it, so maybe tomorrow I'll just insert it into tomorrow's video seems a little weird because it's today's vlog so we'll see um i love meeting everybody today everybody was really kind and they had the nicest things to say to me and oh, i just i really enjoy meeting you and talking to you anyway i'm just i'm getting a little too tired so i'm just gonna finish this video here i love you all very much i hope that this video was useful for you today and I'm really looking forward to seeing everybody tomorrow. And let's all have a good Friday tomorrow. Sleep well, everyone. Bye.